Welcome to the Canadian Union of Skilled Workers. This video is to help guide you through the membership sign-up process. You should have received a welcome email with your username and temporary password for the CUSW applicant portal. This email is very important and outlines step-by-step -step instructions of what you need to do in order to sign up for CUSW membership. Please read the email carefully. First, go to the applicant member website, applicant.cusw.ca. On the main login screen, select whether you are a journey person or an apprentice. Enter your username and password from the welcome email. If you do not have a username, please contact membership at cusw.ca if you are a journey person and apprenticeship at cusw.ca if you are an apprentice. If you have forgotten your password or username, please click the appropriate link. Upon logging in, you will come to a home page for CUSW applicant members. Applicant members are those individuals that have not yet been dispatched to their first job. After being dispatched to your first CUSW call, you become a working CUSW member and you will log in to the CUSW website www.cusw.ca. Until that time, you must log in to the applicant portal to view the job postings. Similar to the welcome email, the home page outlines step-by-step -step instructions. The download for membership, benefit, and retirement forms can be found by scrolling down and clicking on the blue download button. This can be done from either a desktop computer or mobile device. Clicking the download button will open the file explorer on your computer or mobile. Print out each one of the PDF documents in both the benefits and investment and CUSW forms folders. You will need to complete each of these documents and send them to the appropriate departments. If you need help, contact information is available on the applicant portal and there is a README file in each folder for instructions on where to send the documents. Applicant apprentices will need to complete the paperwork for all apprenticeships, benefits and retirement, and the documents in the folder pertaining to their apprenticeship. For your reference, the benefits and investments are through the Power Sector Benefit Trust, PSBT, and Power Sector Retirement Trust, PSRT. If you are interested in obtaining a job at one of the nuclear facilities, you will need to complete the security clearance paperwork. Follow the instructions carefully, and if you have any questions, do not hesitate to contact securityclearance at cusw.ca. We ask that you do not contact the nuclear facilities directly. After completing the sign-up forms, you'll need to obtain your worker health and safety in four steps if you do not already have it. This is acquired through the Ministry of Labor, Training and Skills Development website. Scroll down slightly and click on the link under Training for Workers. You do not need to complete the workbook, however you are required to take the e-learning module. Please keep a copy of the course completion in your records. CUSW applicant members are also encouraged to access the e-learning modules and take the lead available through Alliance Learning. You can access Alliance Learning directly from the applicant homepage and log in using your CUSW credentials. Once logged in, click on Learning Program. Then select Member Participation, followed by Enroll in this course. You must complete all eight courses in order to receive the Take the Lead Certificate. Next, if you're working in a compulsory trade, you'll need to make sure that your membership fees are up to date and you're in good standing with the Ontario College of Trades. Visit collegeoftrades.ca to check your membership status. To recap, you'll complete the membership forms, benefit and retirement forms, security clearance paperwork if wanting to work in nuclear, the Worker Health and Safety in Four Steps Certificate through the Ministry, Alliance Learning eLearning, and check your membership status with the Ontario College of Trades. Please note that it is not necessary to have all your paperwork completed to obtain work. You are welcome to post into jobs for which you are eligible and provide the paperwork before your first day. If, however, the job is at a nuclear facility, you must be security cleared to apply for the job. If you have any questions about the sign-up process, 
please contact membership at cusw.ca or the appropriate department as outlined in this video. Good luck with your membership paperwork and landing your first job with the Canadian Union of Skilled Workers.